Hi guys, I am excited to show you what you're going to be doing with Dash. So let me show you a few things here. All right, so today you are going to get to use the challenge cards. They come in this great box. And then you'll also have a piece of paper that looks like this. And it has all of the levels from the challenge cards. And then you'll also have a little card that looks like this that lets you know how to get onto the app. So I'm going to show you that right now. The first thing you want to do is turn Dash on. So turn him on. Of course, then he goes on the floor after you turn him on. Put him down here. He will beep. And then on the iPad, you remember that you need to find the Blockly app. So I'll go to Blockly. And then it will turn on. Hopefully you'll be able to see it here. It will turn on. And then you'll notice that it is trying to find the robot that it's already been connected to. So I'm going to click up there to see who it's connecting to. And this is where you kind of need to um, really pay attention to the numbers. So the robot that I have is number 21. And you can see, hopefully, that this is also number 21. And I can tell it's connected because there's a little check mark. Okay. If it was connected to something besides 21, like let's pretend like this was number 15, I would want to click on it and disconnect it and then click again, okay, right there in the middle, and then it would disconnect it. And then it would search for all of the robots, and of course, you'll have a whole bunch on, so you'll have a whole bunch here. You need to find your number that you're supposed to be working with. So I'm supposed to be using 21, so I'm going to click right there. All right. And today you are not going to be going to the um, the place you normally go. So you will find your um, your what's it called? Your profile. I'm going to go down here to teacher. There it is. I'm going to go to teacher 21. You'll go to your te your teacher's name and then your number. And you can see I have a whole bunch of puzzles that I normally would go to. But today you're going to do something different. You're going to go over here to create new. Can you see that with the light? Create new. It's all the way on the end. So I'm going to click on create new. And then it says create new project. And you can see up in the corner is blinking where it says blank project. That's the one you want. So you're going to click on it. And then down here at the very bottom, it says create. Can you see that? Kind of. Oops. So create new blank project, and then create down here in the corner. Now, this is exactly what this paper shows you. It says open Blockly app, choose your profile, choose create new, and then click on blank, and then create. So this paper will help you remember how to do that. All right. So once you're on this canvas, you'll see it's really blank you are going to be opening up your challenge cards and starting with the first one, which should be 1.1. And it's really cute. It says, ready, set, go. Dash is ready to go. Um, let's wait for the green stoplight, then Dash can start the race. When you look on the back, it gives you directions. You are going to be completing this challenge by reading these and then doing it on here. So it says, first, the stoplight is yellow. Use this block to make dash turn yellow. So I'm gonna go into the lights. I'm gonna pull out all lights, click on it and make them yellow. So there's the beginning of this code right there. And then I'm going to, it says now make his lights um, go to red. So now I'm gonna do an all red one. And then it says, make his lights all green and you'll get to do all this. Um, and then now Dash can go. Let's add a race animation. So animation and then race. And he can take off. So look, I made this code by this card. Can you see that? It's really hard for me to tell. Okay, so then I'll hit start. And it will do its thing. Its lights are changing. Oh, he started. I don't know if you could hear him. Yay. And once I know, yes, I completed this task, I can go back to my paper and I'm on level A, 1.1, and I can check it off with my pencil or crayon or whatever you're using. Then all you have to do is 
delete all of these blocks. And now I have my blank canvas again. And now I'm ready to put this card back in. And now I'm ready to get out 1.2 and read this one and do the back and all the, all the good stuff that goes with it. Sometimes there's a bonus at the end. Make sure you try that, that's always fun. But if you have trouble doing one and can't figure it out, then don't mark it off on your paper, but you can put it back in here and try another challenge, okay? I would like you to start with all of the A's first, and then if you get done and your teacher tells you to go to something else, you can, but start with the A's for right now, okay? Um, this will not give you directions at the bottom like it does for the puzzles. Sometimes that's confusing to people. But um, really, you are going to be using these cards and your paper to mark off what you've done, okay? So it's kind of you knowing, did I do what the card asked me to do, okay? So this is a little more independence than the other one where it told you exactly what you um, were going to do and it only let you go to the next section if you did it. So this is... Um, a little more responsibility for you, but I know you'll do great and I can't wait to see how you do and hopefully your teacher will send me pictures. Have fun. Oh, one last thing, I almost forgot. Oh my goodness, okay. So when you're done with the iPad, all right, and you go to uh, get out of it, you can hit the home screen, or home button, and then I want you to click it two times, one, two. And when you click it two times, up will come all of the apps that are open. We need to get out of those apps. And the way that you do that is by taking your finger and just swiping up. And once they're all gone, then all of your apps have been closed. And that's important. That's an important way to close down the iPad so that whenever you do this, you go click, click. And if it just blinks like that, you see it blink, watch again, click, click. It blinks, that means all your apps are closed. So you've done a nice job with that, okay? That way the next person who gets into the app, it won't be already open to your profile and things, okay? So those are all my directions. Good luck, I hope you do awesome. I can't wait to hear about it, bye.